Today is Talbians, and we're playing Dominia again. And today we're going to be playing on Pro Gamer Difficulty. So things with Pro Gamer Difficulty is uh, basically you can't keep anyone happy. So things get a little interesting with uh, what you end up fighting. We're going to get an Architect here. We're going to get a Faber, and we're going to get our Sacrados. It's my favorite starting. Uh, next up, we're going to get our training enabled and we're going to train the very first thing here humility so that they can potentially uh, save their lives next up we're going to get everyone training on humility here uh, so that uh, sorry everyone's going to be training up on meditate so that the AI skills are the best that they are before they go into battle and we're going to look at our guys here we got a 51 and a 36 so we're probably going to upgrade this guy's gear here to be the best he can have. Well, by gear I mean his sword only because we're basically looking for damage on the outset here. Uh, the very first battle is the most important and you want the most amount of damage straight out of the weapon. We're going to pray to Mars with our Sacrados here to get better AI skills. We're going to start building a palace here on the uh, architect and the favor he's gonna start repairing gear and start training for automatic upgrade next we're gonna buy some wine uh, we're gonna keep as much supplies as we can on this stuff and we're gonna get the uh, the guys drunk here just up to content so that we can get some patronage going so that they can cover some of the costs and we're gonna is there anyone decent to buy actually uh, we don't even have the gold for that, so forget that, but we will suggest patronage as well. Just to, uh, cut down on our costs, we're gonna rearrange our guys here. And we've got one day till we own a battle, so we're gonna start on the prayer to Venus. Just, uh, just so that the healing happens, and, oh, god. Sometimes I can't quite click on the people here. Alright, so we're up against Apicius. He's, uh, he's pretty low down on the rung of things, 21 damage. 15 AI skill, that's not the greatest, but uh, at least we should have a chance against that since we do 43 damage, and we will accept these terms. He doesn't have the greatest armor, I mean he has the first battle, so, oh, Pappy, Pappy versus Appy, uh, we should win, we need to win, because without the resources we will be pretty bad off, we will not be, uh, will not be a long game if we lose, that's for sure. First victory, so Papias, he's probably not going to be healed in time for uh, things to go on. So we're going to have to make sure that we get uh, anything else upgraded on the other guy. So we're going to upgrade our strength here. He is healing, so it will be close. We will start getting the rest of these slaves meditating. They will probably just be cannon fodder, uh, but they are required. We're going to get our next palace going here. We will make sure that we are ahead on the food, wine, and water. Next up is we are going to get defense. So I prioritize strength and defense over agility uh, just because I feel it adds a bit more to things here. We're going to forget about these guys now. Because at this point in time, we are going to put uh, Weapon Master on her. 25% more damage is great. Uh, the Dr. Ray is done. So we're going to get Blade Control because we want even more damage on these guys. Basically, the more damage, the quicker people die, right? The quicker people die, the less damage you take. Next up, we're going to pray to Vulcan to get occasional upgrades to agility. It seems uh, we are done here as well. Gonna check out our training. It looks like everyone's coming along on the old meditate here. Keep up with our wine and water. And it looks like we're gonna be doing battle soon. Next up is the prayer to Mercury, just so that we get some random upgrades. And we're gonna probably upgrade some gear here. Uh, so it looks like you are up, sir. We will upgrade your helmet a bit here, give you a bit more defense. Uh, so I'm looking for things that will give optimal amounts of defense. Uh, two for that and two for that will be good since these are relatively cheap. Uh, what are your pauldrons here? Take your pauldrons. 
Okay, you take your pauldrons up a few levels here. Uh, and we'll also take your helmet up again. Don't want you getting smashed in the face, my friend. We'll probably upgrade your chest piece here as well. Just give you as much defense as we can. We're up to 50 on the old meditate here, so things should go well for us. Sacrados has finished training once again. We are up against you, Panius. You, Panius. Well, you, Panius, you probably want to get out of the way because old uh, Pappy here, he is an angry man. He is an angry man. So we've got 53 health versus 139 and we do about 40 damage so we're pretty much superior in every way this guy's got basically a little dagger here doing eight damage to us in return so and off comes his arm off comes his arm not great for him wouldn't want to be uh wouldn't want to be part of his school that's for sure uh, that is not what we want we want to start healing up old pappy here and we're going to need to get the new slaves training away here. We're going to start looking to purchase gladiators if we can. Simply because they tend to be better trained. And they come with a reasonable level of equipment here. So we might buy... I like this guy. He looks pretty good actually. Comes with some reasonable equipment here. Uh, so we'll purchase you sir. And we will stick you up in the old training here. Uh, how are we doing? Architect needs to probably gather us some stones so that we can get that front. Oh, see, we haven't finished all of the training. On the Sacrados, he needs to pray to Neptune to basically drink some water and pee out some wine. We're going to need to make sure we're ahead on our food and water payments here. You, sir, are going to need to heal up. I thought I put you over here. Uh, Dr. A is nearly done here. Sacrados is done, so. Dr. Ray, we're going to do shield defense so that we gain a bit better on the uh, shield since we're, we're nearly always running shields, right? Looks like some stone collecting's done. We'll do some more stone collecting. We are at 100% here. Uh, how's everyone else looking? All right, we got a few more hundreds. So we're going to ram down the hundreds and we're going to go to old Pappy here. And we're going to tune back the... Uh, Agility training and make sure that we're mostly doing these three weapon defense and strength Same with the rest of these boys. Uh, we'll probably just do it this way actually Make sure you're down uh, The rest you sir are good you sir are not There we go You are healing up actually you need to be training on meditate uh, And everybody else looks pretty good to me pretty good so we're healing up there. The favor is going to repair all his gear. We're probably. Oh, we need to upgrade automatic upgrade. I always forget that that is not a thing. We'll probably start working on the improved anvil. And hopefully we can win our next fight, which is now. So you can see that the magistrate and the legate are pretty unhappy with us now. So they're going to start giving us some really, really wacky um, fights. It's gonna be, it's gonna be uh, tight lines everywhere normally. Lines everywhere. But we got, all right. His shield's gone. We are doing some drastic damage to him without his shield. That man did not stand a chance. Uh, it is pretty ugly when you lose your shield out there, my friend. Don't do it. Don't do it. All right. We're gonna buy some more food, some more water like to keep everything up as high as I can so that we can uh, ensure that if there is any disasters that we are not going to be starving here. Architect is going to gather us the last bit of stones then we're going to build two more palaces here. Next up is polearm defense. So I like to do polearm defense because you get into deep breathing and deep breathing lets you gain back hit points while you're fighting. Plus, if you ever come up against any of the uh, guys with the pole arms, at least you are going to be slightly reasonable there. You're a money lender, eh? Hmm. Uh, I think we'll offer him Ruvius. Full well knowing that Ruvius has been dead, so have Ruvius here. Yep. Yeah. Escort him off. Escort him off. Good day to you, sir. Have dead old Ruvius there. 
Uh, looks like training is coming along. Done some more gathering of the stones. So we'll get the two last palaces here. We're going to look to see... 166, we probably can't buy anyone great for that. Yeah, we're a bit too poor for that one, unfortunately. So we are going to have to wait for... Uh, business to pick up a little on the old killing front. The old killing front, eh? Uh, these boys are coming along. Pole arm defense will be done. And so is our next battle. Wooden Gladius, man. Old Velgius here is it's getting sent out with pretty much junk. So, sir, prepare to meet old Pappy. Pappy has, uh, he has basically four times your attack. Well, three times. Some shitty mass there, but so be it. So be it. Pappy. Pappy versus Val. Pappy's in, and he is doing mass loads of damage. Good day to you, Val. Good day. Didn't even think of saving himself. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've already got full here. Oh, no. I do not. All right. Excellent. Uh, we will heal up. Get things looking better. Uh, build another palace. Sacrados is done. Dr. Ray needs to be doing... Breathing there, hopefully that will get in just before uh, just before the match. And we're gonna look to see if we can get any gladiators. 202 for you, sir. What are you? 64, 99, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, we'll probably pick you up. Uh, that'll leave us a little poor on the old money front, but so be it. And you sir can heal and get some training. Make sure everybody else is training appropriately here. All right, we'll soon get uh, we'll soon get that other lad going. So we need to make sure we have a nice stable of slaves as well, because we're gonna soon need uh, which palace got done? Okay, that one. So we're gonna gather stones for this palace here. You sir, go on here. The rest of you boys, sort of awkwardly make your way to the front here. Get some more food. Some more water, keep those things as high as possible so that should life become bad, we will not be in the crap out. Uh, we're going to start doing the armor here so that we can possibly start buying decent armor. Wow, this man is well trained. Well trained. Um, he is a little scary actually. A little scary. Let's have a look how Papias compares. So, Pappy here, he's got 11, 14, 11 versus 19, 13, 15. Uh, is his armor? His is a little bit less and his damage is a little bit less. We will probably send Pappy on on this. Uh, it might be a little dodgy, but we do need another win. We might start looking at upgrading some of Pappy's gear since he is currently our main income earner. But he's doing some... Wow, he just... Decimated that man. Oh, Pappy is a angry, angry person. Come here, Pappy. Get some, get some training on you, uh, Doctor Ray. All right. So next up, we're gonna go to some weapon into critical strike. Like to do a bit more damage here. Keep up with our food and water. How is everybody on training? Uh, you are nearly done. Thank God. Uh, and then we can start looking at. Detachment of Pompeii's soldiers come across your villa. Hmm. Uh, what can we offer them? We can give them some. Give them respite. Uh. Oof. My God, I don't really want to piss them off anymore. But. Uh. You know what? So be it. In the morning. Oh, they just stole. Well, they just stole a bunch of our stuff and all of our wine. That kind of hurts, but so be it. So be it. Next up, uh, we're going to gather some stones for this last one here. And then we're going to move into getting some baths. We're going to need some wine here, some food, and some water. We might be able to ease up on the water supply soon. Oh, ah, damn it. I was hoping to uh, get in before get in before this battle 
So sometimes I find it hard to tell if the if the lion is chained. I haven't seen. Uh, it's a roaming lion. Um. So a roaming lion just targets anyone, right? Uh, so I will put in a dodgy slave here. I always send in someone because you do get consolation money. If you reject the terms, you get nothing. Um, but if you just send in a slave, then you do have a chance of getting consolation money that's worth well more than the slave, right? Also, there is a chance this lion may just eat the other guy. And uh, it actually looks like a decent chance since the lion's going to start on the other side. And there it is. Oh, run for it, you fool! Keep running! My god, don't engage in combat! Ah! And he's won! So, I always send guys because, I mean, look at that. He made 80 coin and he's basically garbage, right? He is a slave with no gear on, nothing. And he basically came out and got us some decent money. So always send people, even if you uh, even if you think it's gonna go completely wrong. Next up, we're gonna start building a bath, uh, just so we can decrease uh, injury time and keep our morale up here. And then we'll probably look at uh, probably gonna look at changing out our guys here. So we've got the bath going. Uh, Sakados is done. We've got the armorer. He's, uh, he's doing his thing. We're going to need to get some more food here just in case things go horribly wrong. Meditating. You can stop meditating. Uh, agility is going to be down. How's the rest of these people looking? How is everyone else? 35. You're not done. Alright. Everybody else is training as good as they can. So we're done on the research here. What do we got? We've got some... Obstacles, none. We do have two gladiators here, uh, a Retriaris and a Mamillo, and two lions. This time, I don't think it's going to go so well for us. Um, so I'm definitely going to just send in the Junker here. He is going to do whatever he can, but I suspect he's dead. He is definitely dead. There's a line down here. This is going to be a line over there. It is chained, so this man has got no chance. Uh, pick up your sword and run, fool. Sometimes the, tri the lions break the chains and come on in to join the fray, but fortunately that guy had no chance. And if I'd sent someone decent, he would have just been food, right? Just been food. So, these guys are pretty angry with me now, right? And unfortunately, you just cannot help that. Um, it's just impossible, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, you just have to make sure you've got enough slaves to kind of just grind into the battle there, while these guys, while your actual pros train up and get better. The other thing you can hope for is that uh, some of these guys die. Oh god, another one? This is, is god awful. And he's gonna be chained. Uh, this would be a pretty dodgy fight anyway against some of these guys. So in goes the next uh, unlucky slave. We're starting to run low on slaves a little here. So hopefully we do get a nice, nice submission soon. Because this guy, look at him. Old chain to the ground. He did get a gift, and he's, well, he's trying his best. And his best was surely not enough. Surely not enough. So, we've got two more slaves left here. A distant alone. Oof. Free money. Uh, I will definitely take that money. We sorely need that. Uh, 142, we can't really afford much of anything there. We do want to keep up on the food though. So about a thousand just in case anything goes horribly wrong. 
And luckily our favor is slowly but surely upgrading our items here across these guys. While they also train. Which is great. How's your meditation coming? Alright, you are fully done. So meditation doesn't take long, so you do have to keep an eye on it. Alright, what do we got here? Uh... Two roaming lions. Two roaming lions. This could be an absolute... I would love to just fight this guy one-on-one, -on -one, right? It'd be pretty easy, but... I fear... Uh, whatever I send in is just going to get chewed up here. We might send in you, sir. You have some nice actual flimmin' stats. Uh... I kind of wish you could give them at least daggers before they go in, but unfortunately we can't. I would be tempted to send in a normal guy if these weren't roaming. If they were chained, if they were chained, I'd have a lot better chance. But without them being chained, they just they just maul things, right? Watch this, and they come. He is, he is absolutely stuffed. He, oh, and there we go. And the thing is, is you can just randomly win like that, right? with the lines, which is kind of nice, but it's pretty dangerous. We did get crowd favor. I mean, the poor guy had had no chance, really. But at least he, uh, at least he came through here. Uh, next up, we are going to want to keep an eye on our bath here. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. Uh, so, next up, we are going to look at We've got five palaces, five gathering stones, so that'll keep the main guys trained there. Next up, we are going to want to do... Uh, we're probably going to want to fire this guy and start hiring the educator, uh, which is what we will do. Uh, so we're going to fire the architect here. We're, most of this stuff takes... Uh, I could do it. Mm. It's not really, it's not really great for what you get. Uh, got plenty of stuff here, so we are gonna fire him. We do get to keep everything that we've bought here. We're gonna buy the educator, and the educator is gonna first train us in anatomy. Which gives us a lot more damage and a greater critical strike. And luckily, critical strikes just got done. So next up, we're going to go for rolling attack here. So that we get evasive rolls and uh, everything else, which is great. Uh, how long have we got? We've got nine days here. Hopefully, uh, hopefully one of the legates and the magistrates die so that we can get some... Actual fair fights here. The, uh, the fair fights have been far and few. Next up, we're going to do... Uh, where is it? I know you're in here somewhere. Is it philosophy? So philosophy, uh, basically, plus one AI fighting proficiency. Whether that actually does anything, I haven't really been able to tell. But if it does, then so be it. At least we have it, right? We're gonna heal up this poor sod, just uh, just so that he isn't free free food in his next fight. And we're gonna keep on training. So the thing is, you just want to kind of maintain a group of decent people, right? Because all you need to do is get to the end and fight the 15. And to do that, you have to get there, really. And if I have to throw poor old slaves under the bus, then so be it, they will get thrown under the bus. Next up is focus, so that the training time on everything there gets uh, gets increased. Uh, so the magistrate's pissed with us, there's no way he's going to help us out. Um, probably going to threaten him with physical violence, it's not going to be great. We might, I mean nobody likes us, right? So we're just going to leave empty-handed. Uh, oof, poor, poor Flamin. Poor guys, man. They just got uh, beaten up by old Dominia here. Alright, what do we got? Are these roaming or not? 
Come on. Too chained. All right. They can slip the chains, but if we can do this fast enough, then we do have a chance to kind of end it before they slip their chains and kill us. So we'll accept this, and hopefully we can get in before they break their chains and kill our main guy here. Uh, so we're going to pray to the gods. Come on, boys. Get it done. Excellent. Excellent. Because they... If, as soon as a lion gets in, right, it's just a free-for-all. An absolute free-for-all. On, uh, on who can survive that fight. Uh, so we got 240. Gonna get our next training done here. So we've got a vase of roll. We're gonna do the rolling attack here. Uh, so that we can at least have damage going on. Our food is fine for the moment. We're gonna look to see if, uh... Can we... Ooh. Are these actually stack? That would be interesting. Uh, how much damage? Where's the damage again? Mm. 100 and... What, really? I don't think that's how much damage he does. We'll have a look in the next uh, battle here, but... Next up, we're going to do uh, tr 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 probably the healing or stamina. We'll probably do stamina here. Keep things trucking along. Faber, at some point, we're going to want to... I think we'll do it now. We're just going to improve the furnace so that things can start getting repaired here a little bit quicker. And we have five days till the next battle. Five more days. Luckily, all of our gear is pretty much getting upgraded for free here. Hopefully, have you all got decent weapons now? Uh, you got a free one. Don't know about you, sir. Looks like most of you have just gained wood. Uh, which isn't greatest, but at least it's something. Educator. We're going to do probably the healing here. Just so that everyone can survive these battles and hopefully come out with decent healing and are we gonna get we're not gonna get attack roll sadly we're not gonna get the attack whoa that is way too much way too much uh, there is no way we could survive that if we sent one of our guys so we're gonna send in unfortunately I actually really like these guys um, but without gaining too many slaves we have slight issue here, and this is, there's no way this, any of our guys will survive this fight. He is, he's taking a beating, but, yeah, I just don't like to, just don't like to bet on the ones where it's a possibility to lose. Alright, you sir are up here, and we're going to get the attack roll done. Okay, so after the attack roll, I like to go for the attack vector and attack shuffle, so attack vector just so that he can attack quicker and uh, that net defense might be another option but so far we will go for the attack vectors there looks like everything is coming along we are a little low on everything here hmm your competitor has intimidate hmm intimated that you are harboring a fugitive uh, Uh, phew, yeah, sure. Men leave satisfies that you've broken no war law. Excellent, excellent, excellent. I'm not giving you slaves, bro. We uh, we already don't have enough here. Everybody's training away. We've got 11 days here, and we have 270 left on the old uh, scale of things to do. Luckily, everybody is pretty well trained. Uh, we are gonna want to start picking up some slaves at some point. So that we can feed them on in. Uh, we probably need another actual gladiator. So we might keep we might keep old Pallius there and we're probably gonna purchase a slave for man. One slave, excellent. That is dirt cheap. You sir, just go over there. Alright, we got rolling at uh what did we get? Weight training? So next up is attack vector. So that we can attack just that little bit faster. This guy is finally getting his gear 
repaired. The Faber is going as hard as he can. Last but not least, we're going to get the old psychology going here. Uh, I don't think anybody's going to be in the mood for fighting battles that they're going to lose anyway, but so be it. Uh, have you got space for this? You do not. All right. Fair enough. Ah, my friend, you are doing a fair bit of damage these days if you could actually get out and do a battle. I uh, suspect you would maul the opponents, but fortunately we just, uh, just don't have that option. Don't have that option. My god. Alright, well, I just want to have a look. So he would be doing 168 damage. That's pretty good, but we're going to send in old, uh, old Balbus here. Good luck, Balbus. Good luck against the uh, the swarm of bad guys. My God, he's uh he's a little naked. He's feeling a little exposed. At least the uh, the lion is wow. The lion went down pretty quick, and he's covered in the net. So, yep, not even a chance to surrender. Poor guy, eh? So we're gonna start looking probably at doing. Uh, some pit fights, I think, because we're gonna need, we're gonna need some money here, and we are a little desperate, so we're gonna send an old Pappy here, Pappy's gonna do what he can to win us some money, hopefully against old Stabber, god, Stabber, just, just destroy Stabber here, I don't have net defense, so... It doesn't matter! Stabber just got stabbed! And this is how we get some money. And some slaves. Excellent work there, Pappy. Um, so we're going to have to keep getting money through pit fights here. Simply because the actual fights that we're doing are not going to be in our favour ever. Thanks to Mr. Angry Legate and Magistrate. And with that... We will have a, uh, a slight pause for the next episode. Tune in next time for more Tales of Dominia. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. If you like what you've seen, hit that subscribe button or leave me a comment on anything you want to see in the future.